So for page two, I come back to uh, what I've done before and I look at page one and now I'm going to open page two over the top of it. And I can see that actually the container I made for the text in page one is the same. And for page two, the image div pretty much is identical to the little images down the left plus the text here. So I can probably use the structure of what I have saved for my index page. So let's duplicate these now. So if I come over to web design, remember I had that, there's my page. Let me just close that up. And I'm going to right click over that and just choose duplicate. Just edit, duplicate, or control D is the shortcut. And while I'm at it, I'll make my third page as well. Edit, duplicate. So in this first one, I'm going to rename this page two. And when I open it up, you can see it's an identical copy. When I open it up, I'm going to delete this image. And making sure I've got the cursor in the right place inside the home pick, I'm actually going to insert two more divs, I think. So let's see if I can insert I don't want the bootstrap, I want the HTMLs. So I'm going to put in here one div for the left, which I'll call images. I'll give that ID page two images and it's a new CSS rule and I'm going to place that in the style sheet and all I need to do with that at the moment is give it the correct width I'd say and if I look at the Photoshop image it's going to be approximately 150 wide. So come back here and I'll make it 150. And the float is to the left. And that should just about cover it. OK. So next to that, I'm going to put the cursor down here and I'm going to write page two text or insert another div. Insert another div and I'll call this page two text. I'm going to make that float to the right. Oh, oh shit, does. Okay. I'll need to go back to that. I've accidentally okayed it. So I'll go to my CS designer, select the style. It was page two text. Page two images was on the right. Page two text is should be on the left here somewhere. I'll have a look for that a bit later. That may have gone onto the page itself. If I have a look at the source code. Scroll up to the top. No, nope, it looks okay. I'll leave that where it is for the moment. 